All right, good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, January 4th. Holy cow, it's already January 4th. Feels like half the year's gone already. <laughs> just kidding. We are just getting started. We're going to do a little DoorDash today. Uh, we're not going to have a long day today. I have to work at my W-2 tonight. So we're just going to do a little. And then I'm going to go home for a couple of hours before I got to go to my W-2. So hang in there. I'll be back with you when we get our first order and we'll go from there. Have not got the camera yet either. So um, hopefully today, but we'll see what happens. Alrighty. We sat here for 20, no. Yeah, 24 minutes. <laughs> but we finally got our first order. $5.50 to go 1.3 miles from McDonald's. And that McDonald's is just, I can actually see the arches from where we're at. We're in the mall parking lot. So, let's go get some McDonald's and start this day. All right, we got our order for Dylan. We're going to be taking that just a few blocks. And I noticed on my first video, my head looks around a lot. But of course, I am driving. And for that part, I understand. I'm also looking at my maps. But um, I noticed also, even when I'm sitting and recording, my head moves around a lot. So I'm going to try to work on keeping more of a, a centrally located posture. Um, except, of course, for when I'm driving and recording or looking at my Google Maps, whatever. But uh, I'll do my best to try to get better at that. I also noticed that I tend to take a lot of pauses between talking, so I'll try to work on that as well. Make things flow a little bit better, but it's a work in progress. I'm trying. Um, I'm not... I don't think this is a place that I've been to before. I've been on this road many times. I've delivered to the right side of the road, but I've not delivered a lot to the left, so I'm going to have to try and find this. Oh, okay. Now, I've probably been here. I was thinking it was right in this area, but it's up past 15th Street, so. I'm going to take the camera with me a little bit more today into the restaurants and stuff like that. Try to get you guys a little bit of in the facility footage. But we're going to get this delivered and we'll go from there. All right, everybody, we just accepted a 550, I believe, for 1.8 miles from McDonald's. So, better than two bucks a mile. Captain, incoming message. Uh, 
uh, now I just got a message from my mechanic <laughs> who I don't think it's gonna be my mechanic after he gets done with this project because it is just one disappointment after the other all right we're pulling into McDonald's here um, And they're not very busy, so hopefully this order will be, if not ready to go, close to ready to go. Because this is the worst McDonald's in town, so. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to go check it out. Thank you. Okay, everyone, we're just leaving McDonald's. We've got Lisa's order picked up and it's just going over here to the hospital, to the emergency room front desk. So just a hop, skip and a jump. Simple and easy. All right, everybody, um, we just completed the drop-off for Lisa at McDonald's, and immediately I got a 650 going 5.9 miles for Starbucks. I'm gonna take it. I know it's not great. I mean, it's over a little, little, little tiny bit over a buck a mile, but it's been a slow morning. I mean, this is only our third order, and it's been an hour. So, not going to be breaking any records today. Um, so, we'll take it. Starbucks isn't that far away. Thank you, you guys. Appreciate it. All right, everyone. The reason why this order is got such uh, or rather so many miles is because it's going to the south end of town, which is fine. We go to the south end of town, we're going to have um, McDonald's, Burger King, Holiday, uh, Dunkin'. There's a few places down there. 
that are open right now that we can get some possible breakfast orders from. So hopefully we could stay busy. Like I said, it's been slow. Only three orders in the first hour. Um, and we don't even have the third one dropped off yet. So, <laughs> but uh, be there in a few minutes. All right, we just Captain. incoming message. <laughs> we got all kinds of things going on. This Instacart order just came through ten dollars and sixty six cents for fifty nine units, no tip. So we're gonna hide that one. That's from Target, and DoorDash. <laughs> We just accepted a $3 order from McDonald's on the south end here um, because my app was being slow and so my finger, as soon as it came up, hit the accept button. I could unassign it. We're here, we'll do it. It's only a couple blocks to McDonald's and then a couple blocks to the customers, so. Thanks, guys. Have a good day. Well, we didn't quite make it back to the mall parking lot, which is good. We got our next order, which is $5, going two and a half miles to Starbucks. Go ahead and accept that. It's been a slow day. I'm, I'm kind of surprised. Statistically, you know, I, I've been dashing for over two years. I mentioned that in the other video. But um, statistically, in my market, Tuesday is the slow day. You know, Monday's really good. Everybody's coming off the weekend. I do a lot of Starbucks and Dunkin' orders to places of business on Mondays. And it's not uncommon for me to make, you know, 100 bucks in four hours for the morning shift. You know, I'll start at 7, 7.30 and... You know, by 10, 30, 11 o'clock, I've got a hundred bucks. And 
Tuesday is, is really slow. Usually always. But, you know, for being the beginning of the month and a Thursday, I'm surprised at how slow it really is. But we'll go get this Starbucks order and we'll keep grinding. I'm trying to get enough footage for another video. So <laughs> we'll see what we can do. All right. We've got our Starbucks. I had to take a potty break, man, get rid of some coffee. <laughs> but um, we're taking this to a, I guess, assisted living facility just down the road. So I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a scenic tour. I hope you enjoy. And um, we'll be there shortly. Okay, DoorDash just sent me $2.06 for 2.1 miles from Subway. It's the good Subway, but there's no tip on that order. My acceptance rate's at like 79%, so I'm declining it. Yeah, I was at 80, it went down to 79. DoorDash, you're going to have to do better than that. All right, everyone. We just had a $27.93 come in from Instacart. Shopping for two individuals. 52 items, 106 units. 11.7 miles from Aldi. That it's just not there. I mean, 106 units. I know I said I don't look at units when it comes to Instacart, but come on. There we go. Somebody took it. Actually, I was I was trying to hide it, and somebody took it. So somebody wants that $28. Pretty bad. Probably gonna take an hour to shop. And another half hour to deliver. Hour and a half, 27 bucks, 28 bucks, I guess. It's kind of iffy. It's kind of iffy. But we didn't take it. <laughs> I know that much. Okay. Um, just got a DoorDash offer for $8.37 to shop 15 items at Dollar General. And it's going like 1.7 miles. So I took it. And I apologize. I forgot to tell you guys. Um, I... Well, I hope I delivered that to the right spot. There was an A and a B, and I'm pretty sure it was A. Anyway, um, I meant to tell you guys that they gave us 30 minutes to shop for that Dollar General stuff. It took me 11. 
and I would have been quicker except for there was some Christmas candy that they wanted and I couldn't find it and then the lady goes well check the Christmas aisle I was like oh that makes sense we're probably gonna do like one more order for the morning shift then I'm gonna go home and get this stuff downloaded on the computer before I have to go to work this afternoon start I'll start editing I won't get it all done but I'll hopefully be able to come home and do some finishing touches and get it uh, posted for tomorrow so okay um I'm in a different spot. I did not go back to the mall parking lot. I decided to stay on the south end of town because I actually live eight miles south of town. I figure these first five or six videos, you guys will give me a little bit of leeway on my um, editing skills <laughs> until I can maneuver and manage that program a little bit better. I appreciate all the support. I think we're going to call it a day. We're not getting any orders, so I want to thank you guys. I appreciate the... Uh, subscribe, the likes, the dislikes, the comments. I want to thank you guys so much again for coming along with me. I am Dashing Dink, and that's my video.